realize that you failed? I did not fail. I'm just few points shy. Few points what? Do you know what this means for your education? You are 17. 17 years old. Do you know what it means? I'm sure we can sort something. So, sort, of, sort, sort of what? I don't know. What can we do? Talk to somebody. Pull a few strings. I mean, you can still go. 643 is it's not the worst. I will not do that. I will do no such thing. You will sit the exams again and you will pass it. Hmm. Yeah, I'm not sitting for anything. Will you shut up? No, let him talk. Let him talk. Big mouth. Empty brain. You're proud of yourself. But that why can't I just do A-levels like other normal people? What did you say? Huh? Normal people pass the exams. That's what they do. Idiot. And you know what? I won't spend a dime on any A-level rubbish you're talking about. You will sit the exam and you will pass the exams. If you don't, you stay in Nigeria and you learn a trade. Foolish boy. Don't even have any kind of shame. Yeah, I'm not learning any trade. You shut your dirty mouth. Close it. Are you not ashamed of yourself? Mom, ashamed? There's nothing wrong with feeling, actually. There's something wrong with Especially when you are sitting the same exam for the second time. Mom, look at what you're saying. Is jam not the same thing as SAT? Please, go to your room. Yeah, general, I'm not writing. Go to your room! Damn exam. Um, you just stand and say anything to anyone. You're sitting for no exam. Sitting for no exam. Shut up! You know we're enabling that boy, right? That's why he thinks he can do anything and get away with it. He's my son and he's also my only child. <sighs> he needs to go to school. He needs to learn. He needs to make something out of his life. So that he doesn't have to depend on us for every single thing. Who's to say he would not? Look, there are many successful people that have not gone to school. I just think you are being a bit harsh. Harsh? I am being harsh to say that my son needs to go to school and learn? I'm being harsh? I'm being harsh by, by saying that he needs to make something out of his life? A child who doesn't take responsibilities for his actions and I'm being harsh? Oh God, if only we had another, another child. child. I know. I know. If only I could carry a child full term. If only you didn't constantly Remind me of my medical condition. If only I was just able. Look. Right? You don't have to say that every single time to be heard. You know that that's what I what I meant. Like. Oh. I'm sorry. All right? Oh, God. Honey, I... Oh, come on. Babe. Please, I'm sorry. Please. Oh. Just pay for the extra SAT classes. Anything you want. All right. Please. I'm just 
worried about him, that's all. Me too. It's okay. It's okay. No, bro, that man hates me. I wouldn't even be surprised if at the end of the day he's not my father. Wait, what's your score? Good for you. Me, I'm pretty sure that you did it or played the first one with me. Because how do you explain my score? Bro, I paid them now. Ah, you suppose not some money no be problem. I gave that man the 70k he requested. Check. Sit down. Your father and I have decided you are going to resit the SAT exams. Mom, how could you allow that to convince you? Look, my friends are applying to schools already. You will not be applying to any schools with that score, dear. Oh. Uh, but we've not tried yet now. There are schools that will accept my score without stress. Uh -uh. Stop dragging this matter out. Stop dragging it out. It was very difficult for me to convince your father to pay for extra classes. Extra classes? Yes. Why can't I just go to Canada and do A-levels? Nobody has answered that one. And nobody owes you an answer. Your father does not want the easy way out of this for you. And to be honest, nor do I. Being an only child may also have its negative effects clearly. So, this is another opportunity for you to really push yourself this time. Do you understand? Remember, you promised to get me a PS5 or because I'm a failure according to you and that. You're not getting it any longer. When you get to the store, send me the vendor's account. <laughs> oh, thank you, Mom. Better not mention it at all in this house. Because if your father finds out, he will be very angry. Deal. I need to get in with the PS5. Hello, nurse. Welcome, sir. How is he doing? He's fine. Do you need me to get the doctor? No, I'll see the doctor when I'm done. All right. I think he needs to go home and get some sleep. He's been here since when his father has been around. He needs some rest. He needs some decent rest. Even with the nurses who get shift, I think he needs enough, enough rest. Okay, thank you. Dennis? Sweet. Well, not yet. But all right. Come on, let's go. You need to get something to eat. Okay. I'll go and see the doctor. Thank you, sir. How is he doing? Yeah, I don't know if he's getting better. Mr. Chris, I need to be frank with you. Your brother's condition isn't showing any sign of improvement at all. It's deteriorating at an alarming rate. How bad is it, doctor? 
The truth is, he's not getting better at all. And at the rate at which his body is breaking down is shocking. I don't understand, Doctor. <clears throat> what are you saying? Can you explain to me much better? Mr. Christopher, I wish I can give you a definitive answer. But with the way things are progressing, it's difficult to say. I am sorry. Thank you, Doctor. You're welcome. Thank you. now. What's wrong? Why the long face? It's my brother. Okay. How is he? He's not responding to treatment. The doctor said that we should praise ourselves. The way he said it, it's like we should prepare for a funeral. God forbid. God forbid, bad thing. Mom, please, can you help me pass the pinna bowl? What? So I spoke to the school and they can go ahead with the SATs for Jake. Everything's going to cost 375000 That includes his one-on-one -on -one lessons. I'll send the money to you when I get to the office. Are you still mad at me? I'm mad at the situation, not you. All right, well, let me at least serve you breakfast. Hmm? All right. Jake, we're going out, so please go and get ready. Where are we going to by this time now? 
to enroll for extra classes. Why do I really need to take these extra classes? Ah, I don't know. You may be right. Hmm? You only failed your SATs twice and jump two. Mom, this is Delulu. I did not fail. Did. Like, I can still get into some other universities with my score. <sighs> my friend, just stop. Hmm? Just stop right there. I have so many sleepless nights with my husband on top of your account. So what you're going to do is go upstairs, get dressed, and come down in 30 minutes. Now. I'll be only the guinea. They do not the guinea. This <sighs> rubbish. Do you also take classes here? Hello? I'm outside. There's food. There's food in the fridge, in the freezer, in the pantry. You could have made yourself something easily. Yes, men cook. They actually can. How was your first day? It was fine. When will you come to the house now? Guess what? Mom C got me that PS5 for. No way, bro. <laughs> I swear. I was very surprised there because I felt after that much argument with um, Popsy yesterday, she wouldn't want to you buy want me now. You PS5 now. Ah, are you joking? Damn, bro. <laughs> hey, bro. Look at that. She. That girl I was telling you about. Who is she? Timmy Olotu. Can you imagine? Once you hear all the morning, my dad it's Timmy's father they're talking about. She and I went to the same school. I'm sure I don't want to send her abroad because of this upcoming election. Hello? Where are you? I can't see you. I know that's Lou. Uh, <laughs> I can't what? see. That's okay, I'm coming. Q? Q? Yeah. Is there a Q? Bro, she's a fine girl, man. You have to join the Q. I know you're like trying to get her attention, but me, I'm definitely going to get it.
Hey, Mom. How are you doing? Fine. <laughs> what is it, Jake? Nothing, oh. I just wanted to check on you now. Right. Mom, are you going out today? No, I'm not. So I can take your car to class? Unsupervised? Mom, I'm a good driver. <laughs> My dear, you're also 17 years old. Mom, I can drive. It's just class. It's not even far. The answer is no. Regardless. I never knew a time would come when even you would not like me. But it's still, it's so good. Emotional blackmail. Really? <sighs> Alright. I will... Check with our former driver and see if he can drive you around next week. Oh, mom, yeah, absolutely. The best is. Mm. 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 How the tables have changed. Mom, you've not called him yet. Mm. Give me my phone. Let me call him. All right, that's it. Thank you. Okay. Hello, Mr. Lukeman. Yes, please. Hey, see me, right? Can I drop you off with my car? Your parents' car, you mean? Do you mean I can't own a car or what? You're barely 18. How can you afford a car? You don't really have to be this mean, actually. Coming from a guy who thinks he can win me over with the car, that's just rich. Wow. I just care about you. Good for you. Are you always this rude? Are you always this condescending? Wow, condescending. What do you call a guy who comes for extra classes with a car just so a dumb girl can like him? Look, I'm waiting for my ride, so I'll appreciate if you stop talking to me. Well, I just want you to know me. with us so he will be sharing your room so make him comfortable you know show him around and make sure that he's okay come on let's go okay oh, let me show you the room let 
存在的。嗯。Can I do that? It's called mercy killing, but they need my consent. So, what are you going to do? I can't give up on my brother. I can't. I can't. I, I, I can't. Never. I, I have to. But have you ever thought about maybe what he would want? I'm just saying, what if he's tired? I don't know what to do. I don't. That's fine. But I just want us to be sure that we're not holding on to him for a prolonged, you know, time. Especially if he just wants to rest. You think I should do it? I can't tell you what to do. He's your brother. You know him better than anybody else. I don't know what to do. God. Oh, God. I know, I know. Is that why you brought Dennis home? He's been at the hospital ever since his mother left. I just want him to get some rest, eat some good food, you know, have a warm, warm bed instead of being in the hospital so far. I'm sorry, but I just don't want my brother to die. I swear. I'm sorry. I don't want to lose you. I'm sorry, babe.
Jake! Oh, my love. So clean. Jake? Ah. Here. Jake? Dennis? Oh, it's okay. Ah. Uh, what, what's happening? What, what happened here? I thought I could sleep, so I told I'm sorry, Ma. No, 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 wait. Why are you apologizing? You're angry. No, no, no. I'm not angry. I'm... I'm just surprised. Dennis, did you clean everywhere? Yes, ma'am. When did you sleep? I think around four, five, maybe. Ah, Dennis. I'm so sorry, I should have figured you may have trouble sleeping. Please, go to your room and rest. Hey, Oga. You here to pick someone? Yes. Timmy? Yes. Um, okay, Timmy is my girlfriend. And uh, we had a little misunderstanding, so she wants to go home. Um, I want you to do me a little favor of calling her while I make you a transfer so you could leave. Uh, why are you to be telling me that, this? Oga, I'm serious. I'll make you the transfer right now. Love her boy. <laughs> what am I going to do now? <laughs> okay, just call your account number for me. Okay, two zero. Yeah. Seven one. Yeah. Six four. Yeah. Eight one five two. Okay. Color. Color. Hello, my mom's side. Okay, I just did it right now. Thank you. you let me call. Oh. All right. Thank you. Oh, thank you, boss. All right now. Yeah, All right. Thank you very thank much. You. No wala. No wala. Thank you. This man said he's here. Hi, Timmy. If it's a driver you're about to call right now, I already paid him to leave. You did what? I did it so we could talk. Please, please, Timmy. Please. Hey, Timmy. I really like you. I like you a whole lot. Believe me, please. Says every guy. Look, I'm not every guy. I'm me. I really want to pursue something serious with you. You're mad, Sha. You sent my driver away. Eh, hey, I paid him for that now. That greedy man. Sha would have paid him also. Eh, hey, but look at the bright side of it too. He just earned what he earned without working for it. Okay. Okay. Okay, we can give it a try. <laughs> okay, okay, thank you. Thank you. Let's go. Welcome to my house. 
What you said no one will be home. Just ignore him. What are you doing here? I thought you were supposed to be at the hospital. Oh, well, Uncle Chris, I should stay at home. Jake, let's just go. Come on, let's go to my room. Don't worry. <laughs> Babe, so this is my room. Yeah, welcome to my apartment. <laughs> Babe, let's just let's do this now. <laughs> no, your brother is downstairs. That boy is not my brother, he's my cousin. Potato, potato. What's the difference? <sighs> Babe, let's just, let's just do this now. Let's go home. <sighs> Babe, but you just came now. You can't say you want to go now. Let's just do this, please. Your brother is there, I can't. Babe, please. I want to go home. <sighs> After you. How is he doing? To go to the hospital to see him. <laughs> it's just. <laughs> okay, stop. Stop crying. <laughs> what will I do now that my uncle is no more? It's okay, God knows why it happened this way. So, of all people, why my uncle? Why? <laughs> what happened to him? He was sick and was in the hospital before he died. What was his diagnosis? Um, um. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. Um, what about your cousin? That's his dad, right? Yeah, he's sad. Everything in my house is not just going well. I just managed to come to class today because I wanted to see you. I'm so sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> sorry, please stop asking this way, okay? Get yourself together. Stop this. I don't like to see you like this. Well, what will I do now? <laughs> Sorry. Are you okay? Now? Yeah, let's go. I'm going to my cousin. Yeah.
Hey. If you ever need anything, just anything, just let me know. I'll let your auntie know. We'll provide it for you. We're your family now. Okay. Take this, take this. I'm so sorry. Did you not hear your mother? Listen. Are you not hearing? Ah, it's coming from downstairs. Yes. Who could that be? Is it somebody in the house? I'm sure it's Dennis. It has to be. Dennis? He probably can't sleep now. What the, the kind of sound? It's too loud in cases. I need Truda, maybe it's he for something. If it's Dennis, I'm sure. What are you doing? I'm going downstairs to check on him. No, no, no. I'm going with you. You don't have to, I don't want to. I have to. I'm the man. I have to protect you. Hey, stay behind me. What are you doing? Stay behind me, alright? Be careful. What if it's not Dennis? That's why we keep running downstairs. Well, I definitely told him it was you. Yes, you did. Okay, I think that was the No, nothing. Dennis is fine. Just the blades are not running anywhere. Go to your room and go to bed. Yeah, I think you should go to bed. Okay. All right? Just leave it. It's okay. <sighs> I feel so sorry for you. What if Dennis starts a uh, SAT classes with Jake? To get his mind off things, right? Exactly. Yeah, he's a good kid. Yes, he is. So if you can make the arrangements and uh, just let me know how much I will send the money to you. Okay. Thank you, darling. You're welcome, darling. Come here. Come here. Really? That's how it feels. It's not a good idea. Why? Because I have a reputation. People will look at me like I have no risk. Risk? <laughs> Oga, just make sure he has a soft landing. And there's nothing wrong with your brother going to Mom, the same... Mom, he's not my brother. He's my cousin. Uh -huh. What's the difference now? I don't want to be a babysitter. Nobody is asking you to babysit. Still, I don't want... Nobody is asking you what you want. What you will do is wait until your brother is ready and then you can live together. Ha! 
And that is that. How are you? Fine, ma. Uh, what are you up to? Oh, just sitting, doing nothing. Okay. Um, your uncle and I were talking. Okay. And we're thinking that you should start preparing to sit your SATs with your brother. I don't think that's a good idea. Why? I don't sure think it is. I don't understand everybody. This is a good opportunity. And if you do really well, you may be able to study in America. That's something your father always wanted. I don't want to upset Jake. Even worse not. Jake will be fine. Hmm? Um, Jake, um, so I want to talk to you about something. Um, I'm sorry that says I'm actually missing you your life. Yeah. Um, but, um, because I don't know what it's like for you to share your space with someone. I know we did actually get to bond with last cousin. Uh, but I promise, I won't embarrass you, you know. I'll, fine. I'll still feel part two, so I don't, I don't get to interfere. It's your matters, you know, but... Are you done? Yes. Good. Sorry about your dad. Yeah, thank you very much. Can we go? Oh, bye, Dennis. Where'd you be? Are you okay? Get it from the car, Joe. Don't you have sense? Is everything okay? Yeah, everything is fine. Let's go. What's up, mom? 
What's up? Okay, greet me properly. I'm your mother. Where is your brother? How am I supposed to know? Ha! Oh, wow. Hello. Hey. Ah, didn't you miss me? You. I'm so sorry, man. What happened? Why do you look like this? Ah, Dennis is not back yet. And this time. I'm worried. Jake said he didn't see him at all. You know he doesn't. What is Jake? Jake. Jacob. Dad. Where is your brother? I don't know. I waited and waited. I didn't see him, so I left. I mean, but you don't know. Were well, you not in the same class? But we sat on different places. <sighs> Wait, did you see him leave? I don't know. You don't know? What do you know? Dennis! Oh, thank God. Dennis! What happened to you? I lost my you lost your way. Uh, wait, wait, wait. A car takes you to school and brings you back home. Where did you lose your way? In the car? Uncle Chris, I lost my way. Can I please go into rest, please? That's sure, dear. Go and take your bag home. I know you did something to him. He's not speaking out, but I know you did something to him. If I find out that you are bullying him, or you are being mean to him, I will deal with you. I'm telling you, Jake, I will deal with you. He did something, babe. I know he did something. What did I do? Everything may be a problem.
Jacob. Are you mad? My name is Jake. Oh, sorry. Um, Jake. Are we not going to class today? What's your own? Is my placenta tied around your waist? Can't you go on your own? Yeah. Anyways, I have a headache. Sorry. At least, can you please order that for me so I could get to class, please? Okay, can you please just direct me to class so I'll get to class, please? How am I supposed to do that? Go and ask your fellow ghetto people now. Hi. <laughs> How are you? Welcome. All right, welcome to my house. Thank you. you. see, I told you there was no one around. All right, let's go to my room. Let's okay. go. All right. Thank you. Uh, after you. Thank you. So, how was your trip? Well, okay. Oh. Hope you're good. Yes. Honey. This has become your habit now. Where is Jake? He's upstairs. Sorry. Jacob! Yes, sir. Where is your brother? He's not like it. Hmm. I don't know. <sighs> Honey, I think I need to go and look for him myself. It's almost 8 p.m. He doesn't know his way around. It's not safe. Let me just drive out. <laughs> Dennis? Oh, Uncle Chris. What happened? Uh, oh. Did you lose your way again? Uh, nothing really happened. Dennis, is something going on that we are not aware about? Not really, Aunt Kay. But I'm sorry I made you worried. It's won't happen again. It's not his fault, it's mine. Alright. I, um, I'm thinking since you are comfortable with uh, public transportation, I don't want you stranded anywhere you find yourself. So have some money in your pocket just in case. Thank you, Uncle Chris. Oh, it's okay. okay. You're studying? Yes.
What's that for? What is it? I've been calling you. How could that you remember? I thought he had been buried. I'm sorry. Do you want to hang out tomorrow? We could actually. I can't. I have things doing. Things I want. Well, he does that to me too. And he's supposed to be my brother. I, I don't even know what I did. He just he just changed. See, for Jacob, you don't have to do anything. It's okay. Huh? Uh, oh, no, no, dear, dear. Don't cry. It's okay. Huh? It's okay. I just wanted to ask him if he would like to go to the movies because my uncle made a film and gave me two free tickets. Well, if you don't mind, I can go with you. Really? Yeah, sure. Hi, my name is Dennis. It's a oh, very nice name. Yes. Well, that was nice. So now, how is your day been? It's not okay. It's not okay? It's not so But then when things will be fun. <laughs> it's not when you stop. <laughs> Give him Chris, give him Kate. Hi, Dennis. Um, can I go with a friend? You know, for a movie. Uh, I won't commit a film, so I was actually thinking if I could go. Sure, I don't see why not. Okay. Um, your exam is on Saturday. When is the movie showing? Uh, Sunday, but after exams. <laughs> see, even if. That movie is on the same day as this exam. I'm very sure Dennis is ready. You're ready for your exams, yes, right? Yes, I'm very ready. Okay, Dennis, so you can go. Okay. Um, is she your girlfriend? She's so deaf no. on my mom. Is it I wouldn't have asked the same question. She's just a friend. But no, we are just friends. Okay, oh. yes. Okay. Just friends. Good night. Okay. 
Good night. Just a friend. Yeah. Where are you looking at that? You know how you used to follow me to go to the movies. Hmm? No, you don't. No, I don't follow you anymore. You follow me, that's how you ended this out. You know, you know this out. Where did you start? Where did you start? Where did you start? Go and lie, lie to your parents that you don't. Okay, yeah. Oh. Thank you. How are you? Okay, it's yeah, okay. Hey, um, got something for you. Really? Yeah. Well, it's not my birthday. Doesn't have to be your birthday. I wanted you to have some fresh clothes for your date. She's just my friend. It doesn't matter. Make a good first impression. Make her smile, all right? Thank you, Uncle Chris. You're welcome. Uh, yeah, I know now. Yeah, have you read chapter three? Uh, no, no, no. Yeah, I know, I know. Yeah, I already read that one already. Uh, chapter three. Yeah, I'm in chapter 59 now. <laughs> Mm, okay, yeah, um, just imagine if a prospect was absolutely convinced that you would. <laughs> yeah, yes. Uh, okay, wait, there's actually a subtopic on that too. Um, appealing to customers' needs now. Uh, okay. <laughs> I don't have them now. Yeah, but like, hmm, like, I think. You too, you should actually try to, yeah, yeah, I know now, nah, I know now. Nah. <laughs> hey, you who I'm talking to? Give me one sec, I'm on the phone. My mother is calling you. <sighs> okay, see, my aunt is calling me. Yeah, I'm going to call you back. Yeah, okay. <sighs> Where is she? She's on top of my head, come and find her here. <sighs> So, so great. Congratulations. Thank you very much. Wow. This is so good. have a nonchalant attitude when we're talking about your future. Oh, people just no need to say. Empty brain. First, it was 6.53. Now you're scoring a 9.50 and sad. Who scores 9.50 yesterday? Who? But that I did better than the last time. You know, yourself. You did better than the last time. So you want what? Uh, an applause, right? You want me to clap for you? Huh? 9.50. Which Ivy League school are you going to attend? Who's going to accept you in the school? With 9.50? Dad, have you ever considered, like, maybe, just maybe, I'm not interested in any Ivy League school? Dad, you're dumping on me. This isn't what I want, but what you want. Are you listening to your son? 
that going to an Arabic league school is not part of his dreams. Tim, shut up, bro. Shut your like, mouth. Seriously? Have some respect for your father and myself. Why? Why should I shut up? What did I do? First of all, I was humiliated by my own parents because I scored less in an exam. Uh -huh. Same score other people score and they still get into schools. Some even do A-levels. I suggested it to dad. But guess what? He said no. And making me receive the same exams. Now I score a 950. Boom is still not good enough. What would you, what do you want from me? Shut up! What, my blood? Empty brain! Shut up! You should be humiliated that your cousin scored 1,540 his first trial sat. Ah, sorry dad, that Dennis is not your son. Wait, 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 wait. Dennis, thank you so much. You've made us so proud of you. I will take you personally to shop whatever you want. Once you get accepted in one of the schools, you know, the top schools, I will take you myself. You buy whatever you want. Okay? Thank you so much. Your father will be proud of you. Thank you. Congrats, my boy. Jake, I need to talk to you. What is wrong with you? Oh, Mom, what did I do again? What did you do again? You walked out on your father and I when we were talking to you. You're failing exams. You're scoring poorly. I did not score poorly, Mom. 950 is a solid score. I may not have gotten the Ivy League, but who cares? Your father cares. I care. That hits me. Why would you even say that? Maybe because he's not my real father. Are you mad? Don't you ever in your life call me an adulterer. See, Jake, you can run your dirty mouth and you can spoil your life yourself. But crossing the line is calling me your mother an adulterer. And if you are not careful, you will go to school in this Nigeria. Rubbish. Like, who else to score in Nigeria? You're a genius! Genius, kid. Only a genius can score 1600, Jerry. Oh, you tried. What are you saying? You did well! to celebrate him on his perfect SAT score. Wait, you came to my father's compound to see my cousin? Isn't it a free war? Ha. Oh. Is it because of him you refused to seal the deal with me? I thought you said you were a virgin, now look at you, slut. Don't call me names, Jacob. 
Don't call our names now. Who invited you here? You nobody. Leave him alone, Jake. Now you get out of my father's compound. I said, don't speak now. Dennis, please. You guys should stop this, please. You guys should. You guys should stop this, please. You guys should stop this now. Who is here, please? Security, get him out, please. Soldiers, stop. You guys should stop this now, please. What happened? He fell. So if he fell, what happened to your face? I fell too. Hmm. Stand in the streets. He fell. Why do you let him bully you? Hmm? The good man was there. He saw everything that happened. A girl came to you and he attacked you for no reason. So why are you letting him bully you? Dad, she's my girl. I thought you said you fell down. Mom, ever since this boy came to this house, I no longer exist. He has stolen my parents' love away from me. He has stolen my education. And now he wants to steal my girl. I won't even allow that to happen, no. Are you hearing yourself? Are you hearing what you're saying? Hmm? My girl. My girl. Do you have a girl? Can you take care of a girl? You can't even pass a, a common SAT exam and you're talking my girl, my girl, my girl. And my girl, you're stealing my girl. Apologize to your brother. Dad, why should I apologize to him? We fought. We're supposed to be apologizing to each other. You attacked him. You threw the first punch. But mom, he provoked me. Jacob! Apologize to your brother, or you kiss your studies abroad goodbye. Oh. Fine then. Decision is made. Mom! Excuse me. Oh, Mom, you know, I don't know why you cannot learn how to be responsible instead of doing all this kind of thing. Are you happy now? Did I do anything for you? I really have to do something. Really, I have to do something. So, then this thing is better than me. I really have to do something. All this is happening because they think Dennis is perfect than I am. So, what if... Is it your fault that Jake is badly behaved? Well, maybe I shouldn't have come here. What did your parents say? His parents, you mean? <sighs> well, that's not what Jake wants to be going through, to be honest. You know, he's the only child. You know, he has to share his love, his parents' affection, you know. And now he has to share everything with me. Even his SAT exams, he's not a good girl at all. And his girlfriend, and friends. What's his girlfriend? Oh, my bad. So, what universities are you applying for? Well, my uncle wants me to try big players, big ones. So, Oxford, Cambridge, Harvard. I don't even know. Hey, Dennis. See, Jay. I already have enough bruises already. Look at my face. Come on, look at getting me. Yeah. I'm not here to throw punches. I'm not here to fight. I'm here to apologize. Hey, to me. Hi, Jake. I bet peace offering. Just say I'm sorry. So please, if I'm forgiving, you guys just take this from me. Um, Dennis, <laughs> you're not the problem at all. I think I need to do better. I'm sorry for making here a high time for you. 
It's okay. Understand? So, are we good? Yeah. Thanks, bro. Can I at least get a hug? No. It's fine. I deserve it. You guys just drink up and I'll see you around. What are you about to do? What? Haven't you watched all those Hollywood movies where people pretend to be nice and then they offer you spiked drinks? <laughs> Come on. No, it's 2024. But though, Jake might be a lot of things. But a spike drink. Come on. Is well, honestly, I don't mind schooling in Nigeria. Are you joking? What do you mean you want to? <gasps> Are you okay? <laughs> Dennis! <laughs> Dennis! <laughs> Dennis! <laughs> Dennis! <laughs> Dennis! Please! Dennis! Dennis! <laughs> Dennis! Stop this! Dennis! <laughs> please! Don't you help me! Please! Dennis! 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 Stop this! Dennis! Oh, Dennis! 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 Stop! Dennis! Stop! Oh, Dennis! Stop! Dennis! Talk to us. Mr. Chris? Doctor? Oh, oh, is he okay? We found something disturbing in Dennis's blood work. Uh, 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 what could possibly be wrong? Is, is he going to be okay, at least? We found a large amount of drugs in his system. Drugs? drugs. Yes. Dennis doesn't do drugs. Uh, he's, he's never even smoked a cigarette in his in life. His life? Surely there must be some mistake, madam. Mr. Chris, we often found this with young people nowadays. I mean, they experiment even without their parents knowing. But how could we have missed it? It's not, it's not possible. We, we watch him all the time. We, we know what he does. Mr. Chris, sometimes the most vigilant parent cannot even prevent this. What is concerning right now is what the substance has done to his brain. Hmm. I'm sorry, Dennis is in a condition right now. Yes. Oh my God. How could this is? How could this is happening? What are you doing? No, 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 honey, honey, leave the poor girl. He doesn't do you. She called us. You remember? She called us. I know. I know. Come down. Okay, I'm calm. No, sir, I think Jake spiked our dreams. Huh? What nonsense are you saying? It's no nonsense, sir. Well, we were just outside talking when Jake brought drinks for us, and then the next thing, Dennis froze, and then he started jerking off for me from his phone. What are you insinuating, <laughs> young lady? Hey, hey, hey. What is she saying? Are you sure? What you were telling us? Are you sure about that? I'm very sure. It happened? It happened, sir. It happened. I was there. It's Jake. It's Jake. It's Jake. Jake, Jake, Jake. Hey, what did you do to your brother? I didn't do anything to you. What did you do to your brother? I didn't do anything. Did you poison him? I didn't do anything to you. Did you, did you put something in his drink? Did you poison him? I did nothing to him. Dad, I did not do anything to him. What did you do to your brother? I Tell me, what did you do to your brother? Dad, I didn't... I didn't do anything to Dennis. Nobody boys Dennis. Dennis is here, dying in the hospital, and you were lying to me. He was drugged. What did you do to him? Dad, I did not poison Dennis. Nobody poisoned Dennis. Who knows what he does behind closed doors? Give me this. Give me this. Give me this. That, that is something personal. You dare. Jake! 
You poisoned your brother? Despite our best effort, we couldn't save Dennis. We tried everything we could, but his condition deteriorated rapidly. No, 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 this, this, this can't be happening. Doctor, how can you say this? You said you were doing your best, you said you were doing everything you could. Sometimes. You can't just, you can't just, you can't just die like Sometimes. that. Sometimes. We try our best effort, but the condition was, his condition was already deteriorated and there was nothing we could do. I'm can, sorry. Can we see him early? Can someone no, no, no. see him? I need to see him. Of course, I'll have a nurse escort you to his room. I'm Thank sorry. Dad, I'm sorry. Please. Dad. Please. Dad, it was a mistake. I'm sorry. Please, I'm sorry. Just now. Don't do this, Abeg. Abeg, this is my only child. Your only child that killed somebody? Killed his cousin? It's a mistake, no. He has to learn from his mistakes. He has to take responsibility. Honey. Abeg. Honey, he no. needs to take. He should, he should pay for it. He has to learn something from this. My only he has to learn something from this. Take him away. Dad, I'm sorry. Dad, I'm sorry. Take him away. Dad, I'm sorry. Take him away. Dad, 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 take him away. Take him away. Take him away. We have to stop that. Let him take. Let him take him away. Stop. Stop. No! You want to make me jealous? You want to make me jealous? Please. Honey, stop. 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 Get hold of yourself. Stop. We failed him. Let the system help us correct him. He needs to learn from this. Get out no! of me. Why? You come back. It will be better. Quit you are again. I mean, you don't understand. He could do something to kill himself. He needs to be corrected. Sorry. 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 My one child! Hey. You have killed me! Hey. Quiz, you have killed honey, me! Honey. Don't fucking touch me! Hey. You have hey. killed me! Hey. Hey. My only hey. child! Hey. 